In some cases, the default wallboards might not be exactly what you're looking for and you'd like to actually create a brand new wallboard. Well, how you can do that is quite simply by selecting the drop down in the top left where you would normally select your view and then what you'd like to do is click on create a new view. You'll see there'll be a pop up on the right hand side for a, a nice little wizard on creating your new view and let's give it a name as new test view for argument's sake. And then under your layout options are a couple of options that you can choose in terms of fixing the amount of rows and columns within your view, or you can simply select dynamic. So as you continue to add new tiles to your view, it'll dynamically change how many rows and columns are available in your window. So let's leave that on dynamic. And then under the color mode, you can choose if you'd like a colored background, any sort of colored text, if you wanna change this to monochrome, for now, I'm going to leave this as just a standard colored background and we'll simply choose save. So you can see right now, I have a brand new view ready for tiles to be added.